hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Mar back from Tori, and uh, today we're gonna take another slow episode and we're gonna improve our lifestyle in our house. So, what we're gonna do is we're going to increase our potion usage by planting some seeds. So, I thought for sure what you pretty much had to do was you know build a little blocky area with dirt, cover it with whatever type of thing I want in snow and all that stuff and then just wait for plants to grow but apparently you can use every single seed in a flower pot is that true that's what Empire was telling me so let's go ahead and just try it out I know for sure you can put like blink seeds on that but can you put every type of one there let's test it out so of course I have never made a pot before um, let's go to the blocks we have mud right clay or something like that let's see crimson mud Mud, 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 mud. I don't know. We'll just grab all this and see what we can craft with it. But I don't. Can mud do it? Uh, I don't know. Here's clay. I believe it's just clay, right? Let's put the mud back. Okay. So talk to the crafting guy. And see what we need, need to do with clay. Because if you guys <clears throat> have, you know, you remember me opening up my greenery chest. So much stuff there, and it'd be nice to, uh, you know, organize all that. And just get lots of stuff to so start making whatever I need. So we got, okay, so there is the clay pot. Let's see what else we got. A Ritz to co, all the stuff. So I'll make a couple of these. All right, so all I need is a furnace. Sounds good, six each. Shouldn't be too shabby. <clears throat> okay, furnace, -oo. there we go. Where's the pot, clay pot? Let's grab about 20, five. <laughs> and let's go plant them all there at the top. Okay, let's see. Two. You look at him go. Woo! This is interesting. Okay. Whoa! It's already growing. It's already growing these random plants. Okay, so we go ahead and just put seeds in there, right? I think. I I don't know how these things work. It, look, it looks like it's growing stuff on its own. So let's go ahead and try putting a blink root seed. And if that works, we can go ahead and grab all these other seeds and do it. All right. Ooh, it worked. <clears throat> nice. Okay, so we're gonna be breaking all these, and I guess plant. Well, that's only the blink root. Blink root pretty much grows on anything. Okay, let's go ahead and grab a seed of any other kind. I'll grab a death weed. I don't think that's a seed. Ooh, crimson seed. I I don't know if these like do anything. So we're gonna go ahead and put it on there. Ooh. Corrupt seed. I, I mean, like these are seeds that pretty much spread land. I don't know if they actually give you what you want. So water leaf one, death weed. There we go. There's the death weed seed. Day bloom seeds. And some moon glow ones, and the rest of these other ones cannot. I, I wish there was like a sorting button, you know? Okay, so I know for fun we'll try the corrupt stuff, but I don't think it's gonna happen. So any other seeds I can grow? No lime kelp, jungle grass seeds. So yeah. I'm going to have to definitely um, organize this whole place out. Let's go ahead and grab all the seeds. I don't know why I grabbed one of each. All right. So yeah, let's see if they grow. And you know, once they do, I can go ahead and check out the different types of potions I can, of course, make with it. Let's begin with the blink root ones. Two, three, four, five. And of course, this crop one shouldn't do anything. Yep, of course. These are just ones that you put on land, definitely. So moon glow, we'll start all the way here on the right. Oh no, you can't. Okay, you can. Really weird. How come it's not? It wasn't letting me place it. It's really awkward. All right, so that's moon glow. Looks like it's going to the side only. Then we have the little day bloom ones, which grow pretty easily. We got these things. And then we have one water leaf. And here's hoping that once it grows, it gives me more seeds. The death root ones. Okay. And we'll fill the rest with, of course, this. Okay, that sounds pretty cool. Sounds pretty good. Now, I don't know how long it takes. It looks like they're growing at a pretty steady rate. Um, I don't know if this is fully grown. I'm just going to break it. Probably not, right? Yeah, it's just... I got a blink root. No, I did. I did get it. Hmm, interesting. Um, is it only a chance that it gives you the seed back? Hmm. Because if it doesn't give me the seed back... Or like another seed. Oh, maybe that's you know that's the thing of growing it in the pot, right? It grows it fast. It grows it on any other surface, but 
you don't get the seed back. I'm guessing that's probably it, right? So let's go ahead and put all the stuff away. All the seeds so I'm not gonna use. Put these ones on the right. These are the, these are corrupt ones, which I have nothing to do with. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, let's grab all of these you know materials that I can use with potions. And we'll see. Growing and vile. Oof, vile. And we'll see what kind of potions we can actually make with them. You know, test it out. All these orange dye stuff, put it over there. Acorns, bleh. Cactus, don't need to do anything either. Teal dye, yeah, I definitely need to um, fix this up. Crimson seeds, put that together. Jungle spores is pretty much done as well. Vine, done. Water leaf, definitely do something with that. Cactus, so everything that I'm not going to use is to put on the right. And a prickly pear for a pink dye. And a moon glow. Okay, so there's a lot of materials. And I don't even think I have like all of the, um, you know, all the grassy materials that you need, right? All of the um, stuff, catalysts for potions. Oh, look, look, okay, there we go. Look, I broke these ones, but this one looks a lot more grown. Maybe that one will give me the seed. Yes, you get the seed because of that. Okay, perfect. So, yeah, Psh, I broke it when it was only a little babby. Gotta wait till it's all grown. So blink root grows super fast, and you can see the rest of these ones aren't really glowing at all. Growing at all. Um, maybe they just take a little longer. We'll leave it there. I mean, I plant it, right? So I'm assuming you can leave it there for a while. Okay, let's go ahead and craft. Moon glow. What can we craft with the moon glow? Lots of stuff. Oh my god. Okay. Ooh, this one would be great. Moon glow, death weed, and a fallen star, which is, you know, not that shabby anymore. Dang, magic power potion. Splunker, two Splunker ones, two different um, types of ones. This is pretty nice. <clears throat> <clears throat> Increase the chance to get a crate. Crate for fishing, I guess. Builder potion, lots of potions. Summoning potion, increase your max number. Hmm. Life force potion. This will be amazing, but you need a certain fish for that, right? Is that a fish? Shiver thorn. Ooh, I don't even have a shiver thorn. So, the kind of potions I would probably create with this Moonglow is, you know, according to my current uh, weapon set, it would probably just be the Magic Power Potion. I can make a couple of those. Nice. Really good for boss battles. Let's check out the Water Leaf. <coughs> obsidian Skin. Okay, that's a good one. Fire Blossom, Water Leaf, Obsidian. Let's see. Fishing Potion increases your fishing skill. Sonar. Slipper Potion. Alright. The Water Leaf isn't that great. I'll definitely use it for the um, the powered up water one. Not the, no, no, that was moon level. But you know, water leaf, it's meh. It's nothing I really want unless I really want to keep fishing. Crispy honey block, really? You need a crispy honey block for that. Interesting. So yeah, water leaf doesn't look like it's gonna be you know doing me too good. Here yeah, we got some mushrooms, which just creates a, ooh, a bowl of soup. We have just ooh regeneration. I need that regeneration actually. I, I never use one of these, so yeah. <clears throat> these turn into regular ones, which of course I can just buy from the shop and turn them into something else. Ooh, Darren the Painter. That's right, because last episode everyone died. Okay. But yeah, definitely want to make this regen potion. So that's going to be easy. So everything that I'm going to use will be on the top, everything on the bottom. We'll just put it away. Death Weed, stuff on the top. Magic Power Potion, of course we needed that. Battle Potion, how easy is that to make? Um, yeah, vertebrae, death weed, that's it. Thorns potion, I'm not too um, keen on making a lot of these. Gravitational one, ooh, <clears throat> this one needs a lot. Eh, it's not too bad, the only thing that's difficult getting is the fire blossom seeds. I do have fire blossom, but I don't have the seeds. Look at that, everything back up there still, they haven't grown except for the blink root. I'm really concerned about that. Crate potion, blah blah, blah. titan potion. Rage potion. Ooh, wrath one would be good, but once again, you need a certain fish, which sucks. Teleport you home, so as to make someone smell terrible. Great. All right, so let's see. With this death weed, of course, we need it for the magic power potion. So we'll put it at the top. Vile mushroom, which creates vile power, which doesn't have anything to do with potions. Day bloom. Regen. Oh, okay. Ooh. So we got this one. I need this one. I need. This is what I need. Oh my god. Um, freaking Daybloom is great. Yeah, Daybloom is, is pretty good. Okay, so we need a lot more of these, definitely. 
Next is the glowing mushroom, which um, is pretty good for making potions like this. Uh, ooh, Jake the pirate has arrived. Cool, because we finished our first. I didn't even know that the pirate was gonna happen, but we killed our first, you know, pirate in a little area. So should be popping up. Ugh, my nose. Okay, so shine potion, whatever. Mana potion, healing potion. We need a lot more glowing, glowing mushrooms. So yeah, it's not growing. It's not growing. Let's look. Anything else? <coughs> no, no. Shroomite bar. Chlorophyte plus that. That's cool. Let's finish looking at the rest of these. So glowing mushroom, yeah, need it. Deathweed. Didn't I look at that? No, I looked at the other one. I looked at the... Uh, no, no, it isn't. Oh my god, why is it? There's the pirate. Mr. Jaku. Alright, before we check it out, let's finish the potions. Obsidian skin, gravitational. Inferno ignites nearby enemies. These are really amazing, but once again, you need the... You know, the freaking fishes for that. It's crazy. And finally, our blink root, which uh, should do a lot. Useful. Um, useful. Alright, so all of these ones at the top, we can start creating into potions. I, I really want to get at least a couple more before I start, you know, building in bulk. Crafting in bulk, sorry. Why aren't these things growing? The blink root is definitely going somewhere but the rest of these aren't is it because it's not the right correct biome or something like that huh okay jake stay stay off me booty you scallywag what do you got okay it's gonna be interesting cannon what and cannonballs to 300 damage Woo! pirate hat vanity vanity and a sail can be placed so we can make a boat right which is kind of weird for, um, you know, Terraria, of course, on Minecraft. You got a boat, we got endless ocean. Here, ocean on the left and the right, and it's not even that far, you know? So, sail is bleh. I mean, no, no, sail is... Oh, I'm stupid. Sail is probably... Well, yeah, you can put on the walls or something, right? Yeah, I'm stupid. But I, I believe they added some sort of boat, right? Um, in Terraria? Oh, my God, I can't get rid of it. Ugh, whatever, I'll leave it there. Oh, well, yeah, um, I guess the only thing that's really great from this guy is the cannon... Cannon the cannonball. It's very, very interesting. Never seen that before. So, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, harvest these blink roots again. I mean, blink roots, like, apparently, would have, like, a crap ton. But why aren't these other ones growing? Um, is it? But very slowly? I can't tell. Oh, my God. I'm going to need your help, guys. Um, why aren't they growing? Is it because I'm not in a specific biome? I believe that's right, right? Because bleak roots can be anywhere. But these ones need a little bit of their gra of their little dirt, right? I have no clue. Otherwise, but why would they let me plant it? So, please, help me out. I would love to know. If you guys enjoy, leave a like. It helps so much. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. I upload a lot of daily videos. More tutorial on the way. Slow episode, but we're getting, uh, you know, we're trying to master all the potions, see exactly what we need. And so far, we're doing okay. And, you know, in the future, we'll come across even more materials. And we'll check that out. So, why aren't these guys growing? Thanks for being here, and I will see you guys next time.